new owners and new shareholders all want this and get this problem solved it will not only boost deliveries but essentially make the car flawless now i want you to take a look at this video this is of course the new ito m7 powered by huawei and their harmony os take a look at this so this right here is the rear display screen on the huawei ito m7 and as you can take a look it's magnetically attached to this thing called Huawei MagLink. And it's very, very portable. If you don't want it, just take it off. And it wireless charges, uh, wirelessly charges it. And also, the best part about it, of course, you can take it home. As long as you bring it into the car, it's automatically synced with the center computer on the front display. So you can actually control it through the front display. Control everything. Volume. Uh, brightness, uh, what apps to play, and you can also lock it up if you have kids in the back and you don't want them to play with it, you can lock it up so that they can't do anything with it. And uh, the, the, the delay apparently is pretty much virtually no delay. Uh, th this is crazy, this is insane. You can play anything, you can use anything. It's pretty much Harmony OS, any Android app, it can run. Uh, it, it can be educational app as well and what's really nice is uh, if you say you have kids in the back you don't want them to watch cartoons you can make it so that you lock the screen and only play educational videos or educational apps etc and lock it up so that they can only study in the back and the viewing angle itself is also more natural at the same eye level and not up high or down low that you have on the other cars like in Li Auto you have to look up high and the Tesla you gotta look down low so this is all very natural and very very portable and the most amazing aspect of this is the fact that the, the Huawei Link itself you can actually take the thing off and that thing doubles as a portable battery bank can you believe that there's a 27 watt uh, outlet over there and you can charge your phone or whatever you want and that, that's just that's just insane that is the next level of infotainment that we really need here on a neo again willem lee the ceo is really against having screens in the back because they think he thinks that screens are too distracting it's bad for kids eyes sure have this solution you don't want screens don't put them in the car you don't want screens keep the tablet at home if you want screens sure just magnetically attach it my son absolutely loves teletubbies and i have to watch it with him it would be so much better if i had that screen in the back and i can just let him watch it of course he can't wear any ar glasses but then at the same time i can lock the screen and make it so that he can only watch educational stuff or bring it home one of the biggest complaints amongst a lot of new owners is the infotainment in the car Sure, the air glasses is absolutely fantastic. It's just a massive 200 inch screen on your face. Lots of flexibility. You can lie down and look at it. But some people just want the flexibility of a tablet and what you can do with a tablet. So obviously, Neo is working towards this with the Neo phone first integration with the car via the phone. But soon, a tablet as well, a Neo tablet that can do pretty much all this kind of stuff. Am I hating on Neo for not having this? No, absolutely not. And sales of this vehicle, Ito, not that good either. I mean, this is just a, a one solution that makes the car more uh, better, right? It doesn't change the overall car itself. And Neos in general still have much better overall car compared to that car. And deliveries speak for themselves. These cars barely sell. They sell maybe like 2,000, 3,000 a month at most. They only sold about 3,200 in August, which is tiny compared to Neo. Once again, you buy a car for a car, not for the screens. But this way of solving this problem should be absolutely implemented in a Neo. Now, guys, there's a phrase in Chinese called Bing Xiang Cai Dian Da Sha Fa, which I want you guys to learn. And that just means fridge big TV and a comfortable sofa and people have been saying that that is the secret sauce for Li Auto's success and as you can tell Li Autos have been delivering like crazy now indeed Li Autos have very comfortable seats and then they got like tables and then they also got very big screens and they also got a fridge everything combined so right now Neo's vehicles especially the ES8 which goes toe-to-toe -to -toe with this car 
has comfortable seats and has a fridge inside as well what it's missing of course is the big screen big tv screen and a lot of companies here in china have tried to copy liato's formula of putting a big tv screen putting comfortable seats putting a fridge inside the car and they have seen very very good success with this you see lee auto got its success mainly by offering customers what they wanted now neil right now is almost there they have the sofa part down they got the fridge part down imagine how sales will be if they were able to nail the rear infotainment and not just with glasses because everybody else also has ar glasses but a legit screen infotainment screen somehow and with this kind of tablet integration that's perfect for a company like neo but we'll have to see what kind of integration the phone has with the car and gradually surely slowly but surely neo will have that tablet as well and hopefully one day we can also do this kind of stuff because i'll be very honest i'll pick a neo every day but rear screens my wife loves them chinese people love them some of the bosses they love them some of the bosses they rather have a big screen than ar glasses and also when you're doing a presentation within the car or, or, or watching something important with uh, other people you might not have that many glasses to go around to to give everybody a pair of glasses but you got to see the entire ecosystem that neo is working towards neo right now has a better car than huawei does but Neil eventually wants to become pretty much the apple of China. Phones, all these sort of uh, electronics, and then, of course, the car, battery swap network, new houses, new life, everything combined in one giant ecosystem gets you trapped inside like I am with Apple's ecosystem and pretty much become the next Apple. And it might be possible that in the future, one day, Neil actually surpasses Apple because of the whole entire ecosystem. All right. Remember, ecosystem is more important than one single product. The iPhones may not be the fastest phone or the best camera on the phone, but the ecosystem makes people want to buy it. Same thing with Neo right here. You got to see the bigger picture, all right? In the future, Neo will be the brand for everything. Clothing, snacks, food, those are all minor parts of the ecosystem. Electronics, transportation, entire social life, that is the bigger picture right there so the future is very bright news not perfect but we will eventually get there in the future what do you guys think about this solution for rear displays i absolutely love it a lot of people absolutely love it as well but do you guys love it let me know in the comments down below as always stay safe stay healthy peace out